Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 37, and this is war number five, and we're going up against an alliance called Legionati. So let's go ahead, <clears throat> let's see, we got Corvus. Wow, they banned Corvus, Hercules, and Nimrod. Interesting. And globally banned, of course, my guy. And... Uh, Torch is ban immune. All right, let's take a look here. I'm getting in here a little bit late. All right, so I take path three. Now, this Nimrod here, I normally go in here with Namor, but I'd be very nervous to take that Nimrod with Namor here. Hmm. So, let's see, yeah. So what I might do, I may have to um, try Nebula. Uh, hopefully she'll be able to handle him here just like she handles him on some other nodes. And then, of course, Namor can take that guy. Um, I don't know. Let me see. All right. Well... It's masochism. If I brought Nick Fury, he can take that fight. So can um Claire. I think Claire could take that fight as well. And then we've got Omega Sentinel. Nebula should be able to take this fight. Yeah. But that regen buff, I'll bet you they put her, um, they placed her with suicides, so she's going to get a regen. Hmm. That can be annoying. I'm not sure about that one. Um, but I might try Nebula. Then we've got Guardian here. Um... Nebula could do this, but so could uh, Claire. And this, of course, Claire. And this one here, uh, Nebula could do as well, if I need to. So let me think. I could bring Namor, but if I brought Namor, he's there for just this one fight here. Hmm. Claire would not be good at this fight. Neither would Nick Fury. Um. Nebula might be able to. Let me see. Uh-huh. So bleed, incinerate, cold snap, frostbite. So yeah, Nebula might be able to do this fight as well. So I might bring in Nebula, Claire, and Nick Fury. That might be the uh, that might be the team I go in with. All right, uh, let's get on with the fighting. All right, so. We're going in with Nick Fury, uh, Black Widow Clairvoyant, and Nebula. And heads up, we get royally wrecked in this war. Uh, we encounter a particular defender for the first time, and it was ugly, but we learned, okay? So anyway, we got the first fight up. It's Nimrod. And anytime I see Nimrod, I really think about using Nebula. Now, on this path, however, I was like, hmm, I don't want to use uh, Namor because that's who I usually use, right? Um, but this is Nimrod. So you'll notice I didn't even bring Namor. And I was like, oh, I hope this works the way that I think it's going to work. All right. So we're just going to fight him the way we normally do. You know, build up. He doesn't have that. Now, why all of a sudden I just started getting hit? 
I don't know. It's fun, isn't it? You know, you know that I'm trying to hold my block to build it up. But, you know, maybe my finger twitched or something. Go figure. All right, so I got 20 up. I can evade his uh, heavy against the wall, no problem. All right, see how I was trying to stutter my um, attack to, to make sure I got enough damage. All right, so here we're going to build it up again. He can do that heavy attack all day long. I'm waiting for him. Okay, we got you. We got you. I got 20 again. Now this time, I want to try to um, fire off my special two when I get the parry. So there's the parry. Now I'm locked. And see how I, boom, saw what I did there. So I wanted to get the special two, but I know I'm special locked, right? So I hit him, I parried, and then I backed off. And that gave me enough time for it to go, you know, expire, and I was able to fire my special off. Another way is to just kind of slow attack, but I'm not so good at that. <laughs> so we did it that way. But we got it. Uh, uh, Nimrod went down, no problem. And I'm going to do the same thing here with uh, uh, Nebula against uh, Colossus. I tell you, I, I have to admit, I remember hearing people say how good Nebula was after her rework. But this particular style here, I'm not really the biggest fan of. I don't like being in the corner here. It's the same reason I don't like uh, fighting with Quake. Just don't like it. However, it's effective. You know, if... if uh... Now, check that out. I was taking damage. I was like, whoa, what was going on there? but it's the no. That's why you don't hit them. <laughs> you stick to just parrying with Nebula and get the shots on them. So here, I'm just trying to build up and he's trying to hit me with his heavy. Look at this, just spamming his heavy at me. Look at this. And I'm just like, man, come on. It'll only hurt for a second. <laughs> come on, it'll hurt for a second. Tried to get a reparry, it didn't work. Hit him once, bam, got it. And we just waiting, wait it out, and he drops. Man, that was not as easy as I thought it should be. Because I tried to, I, I forgot in the middle of it and went attacking him, forgetting about the node. All right, so we've got Falcon, uh, Captain America, Sam Wilson, I guess. Yeah, Captain America, Sam Wilson. Now, this is an interesting fight this 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 war was educational shall we say so i'm just like okay well i should be able to just get him down no problem right <laughs> i haven't fought sam wilson a lot all right so i'm looking and i'm just like okay we're doing good he's getting that little regen but okay i'm special locked i'm like all right don't really need special locking. I mean, I don't use my specials all that much, but I'm looking at his health and I'm just like, okay. And then you notice I'm hitting him and then suddenly his health stops going down. Boom! Whoa. First life gone. I'm like, whoa! That thing hit my block or something. And I'm just like, oh, that hurt. And down. And I'm just like, wait, 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 wow. what just happened? I thought I had him. I was like, okay, we about to fire up the special everything. Did, did he go unblockable or did I just stop blocking? I'm just staring at this thing like what just happened? Now, if I hadn't lost Fury's life that first time, we wouldn't have been in that kind of dire straits right there. But I was, I was like, oh my goodness. Next time I fight him, I might just use uh, Claire instead. I honestly don't know what happened there and, and how I died. You know, I know that special two, even into your block, does a heck of a lot of damage. But I thought I had him in the end there when he just started hitting me. Now, this fight. This is the first time anyone on the left is facing Omega Sentinel. 
I have not fought Omega Sentinel on this node. And you see that an attempt was already made. All right. And they were like, yeah, you, you're going to have to see if you can get her down. And I'm looking and I'm just like, oh boy, vigorous assault. Nah, that's not going to be fun. So just watch how this fight goes. So I got the vigorous assault thing, right? Which is why I dashed back. Because I was like, yeah, she's going to be repairing. And then it just wouldn't move. Now, I was already dashing back because I saw that she was unblockable. And I knew she would be. But look at this. Every time I get a... Um, I, I dash... I get a buff, which gets nullified, and she gets regen, which means she's unblockable. And I was like, oh boy. All right, so we're gonna have to try to just get her down straight, you know? But don't forget, <laughs> that hurts. I should have. And she also has an auto block. So that was the first run, and I was just like, man, she's off the chain on this node. All right? But I did, oh, I did some work. Good. I did some work. And I was like, wow. And and I was thinking, I can't use Nebula because if she's unblockable, I won't be able to get the, the parry off. And I don't know whether getting all the charges would uh, shut her down. So now at this point, I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna have to go in, bait heavies, intercept. That's what we just gonna have to do, okay? And she's regening way back up. That regen moving quick. And I can't nullify. What the? And she hits me and I'm gone. I was sitting there just like, okay, so we ain't gonna have no um oh no uh, uh attack bonus on this one. But it's education. And I'm like, wow. We gotta put ours on on this node you know this is a rank four omega sentinel nasty but we learned we learned and we've got a counter all right so i'm just going in and i'm basically treating her like stun immune you know that's that's what i can do treat her like stun immune baiting out the heavies and i went for the attack because i see that she has four uh, armor ups and I got the evade there and then and she then auto blocks auto because block. when she's defending she I? gets five armor ups this girl is off the and train. I can't nullify it wow. so bottom line is we went in here unprepared okay we were unprepared for this Omega Sentinel now something about me I ain't gonna she let that stand the I'm gonna chain. keep going until I get her down just just know that we don't have any attack bonus all right so i decided to just go in with um nebula just to see what she could do because i wasn't sure if it was going to even work okay and here we go here we go we got eight charges and see right now i was able to get the parry off because i didn't do i didn't have any uh buffs for them to nullify right just then Okay, so we did, you know, we did good. And I'm looking and I'm like, okay, so at least I can see how I might be able to use her to get Omega Sentinel down. Wow. So maybe we should have tried uh, Nebula in the first place. But in my opinion, Nebula is not a good option for it. She can work. Mm. But you want to go in with somebody that doesn't have um, buffs or is immune to nullify that's really what you want to do so we got her down it was ugly but we did get her down and in later wars we got an answer for her so anyway now i gotta deal with guardian and i'm not thinking this is going to be very difficult at all guardian is straightforward I just have to remember not to fire off my specials because he'll auto block them and then wreck me. So I don't want to do that. And as you saw there, I was trying to decide who I wanted to use for this. You know, um, 
Nebula, I could have used. I, in fact, I could have used any of them. And I'm finally running out of uh, health potions, team health potions. I should pick up a couple every now and again, but um, I'm not going to spend the loyalty on it. I just really don't want to do that, and I'm not going to use units. So chances are, if I have, if I run into some issues, I'll just revive. It's cheaper to revive than to uh, try to heal back up. But sometimes I do want to heal and give it a good shot, you know? Especially if the war is a little close. Uh, I don't remember where we were at that point. All right. So I'm looking again because I can't remember if he's shock immune. That's what you see me. I'm looking here. I'm like, is he shock immune? And I'm just like, you know what? Let's just go in with a uh, uh, Claire. Don't have to worry about it. <clears throat> and pretty much all I'm trying to do at this point is a straight fight without specials. If I get to a special three, then I can fire off a special three. But none of the others. And blocking that is the safest option. It doesn't do that much damage. Um, and it's much better to just go ahead and block. But as you can see, I sometimes like to dex it anyway. Didn't even need a fi uh, to fire off any specials. So that's pretty much how to deal with a uh, guardian. Just got to remember not to fire specials because you will get retaliated on and wreck. Now, Terax. Terax, you already know who we're going to choose. It's going to be Claire. She is a great option for that Terax, any Terax, really. Uh, I remember fighting Terax in the gauntlet when it first came by, and I did not bring her. Of course, I also didn't have a rank four Claire, and I ended up using Quake, five-star Quake, and it, it was painful. It was really painful. Now, this, I just went in, and I was just ignoring everything, right? And I'm looking at his health, and I'm looking at my health, and I'm like, hmm, what's going on? I, I'm beating him on the health race. Done. But I was still taking some damage, so I was kind of watching to make sure I wasn't losing more health than he was about to lose. So we got him down nice, quick, and easy. Very straightforward. All right, so that Omega Sentinel boy, woo -wee. All right, and you can see here, uh, they still got uh, folks to fight there. And so I'm like, hmm. Because I can't remember. I know the nodes changed a little bit. It's not the nodes that I used to uh, deal with all the time. So I'm like, should be able to take this. We should be able to handle this. Warlock can be a royal pain, let me tell you. We definitely don't want to choose Nick Fury. Um, but I am thinking... Nebula. He's a robot. And even if he puts a shock on me, so what? Don't care. So she's really good. And you can see here, I just wanted to heal up, give it a, a good shot, you know. And we're just going to do, uh, you know, fight Warlock Nebula style. As you can see, he's getting a regen, but we don't care because when we unleash... The beast. It won't matter. Okay, just hitting them to give me some space because I really don't like being in that corner. I really don't. So every once in a while you see me, you know, go attack him just to push him back so that I'm not trapped in the corner. And we don't have to worry about getting uh, degen damage because we're a robot. Okay, here we go. Boom, shakalaka, and done. All right, so that is the end of my participation in this war. I did not fight anybody on Boss Island, uh, so we're all good. And in a moment, we'll be back, and you'll find out how this world, world, huh, how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. But let me tell you, you can't get closer than this war right here. I want you to take a look at the points.
Battle group clears. 60,000, 60,000. Explored. We both explored. Attack bonus. Same attack bonus. Defender diversity. Same. Attacker kills. Same. Defender kills. Um, a lot of ours, as you saw with um, Omega Sentinel, didn't count. But a lot of theirs didn't count either. Okay. And look at this. We won because of our fight duration. We finished fights earlier. So it actually went to a tiebreaker. All right. So Legionari. Good match. All right. That's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.